Let me tell y'all what happened. You niggas just turned me the fuck off. I don't even want to be around y'all. He said, why you call that at? Make she look like 555 City. Um, do I even have to say what I just got done doing? Y'all just got off work. Of course, it's all I do is get off of work. We're about to go thrifting because I just need some new things in my arsenal. It says it's 18 minutes away. I was in there beefing with the motherfucking kids, allegedly, because you know I can't get sued, not too much. He over there talking about he don't want to watch the TV show. I said, what the fuck is this fucking conversation? We talk about you don't watch no fucking TV show, nigga. Like, you're in school. You don't have no choice. You don't have no options. So I was like, all right, cool, whatever. He stepped out in the hallway. I'm not even asking you to do no work. I'm not asking you to be quiet. Like, you can still talk over the video. You can do whatever you want. Just, just sit down, bro. Like, you really tripping over nothing. He talk about, you need to shut the fuck up. Da -da -da. Oh, I need to shut the fuck up. You already know. I don't give a fuck how you feel. I don't care about none of that. Go ahead and sit your funky ass down. No, I'm not going to sit the fuck down. I'm not going to sit the fuck down. Guess what? We'll stand out in this hallway all the way into the end of the motherfucking day if we had to. I don't fucking mind. You think I don't got no stamina for your little punk ass? Because I do. Oh, wow. Uh, my underwear is so deep in my ass. Sorry, y'all. That was inappropriate. I apologize. Let me get the fuck out of the way. Every time I play Sassy Red in this scat pack in this baby mama car, why would people be looking at me, y'all? Like, this is too much. You know what I'm talking about? You know how the cars be stagnant? Like, I be trying to lean my shit back. Niggas be leaning their shit in reverse to look at me, bro. I just want to get it sexy. Get it sexy. Get it sexy. Can't even get it sexy. This shit too much, bro. Y'all, I tried texting this new nigga. <laughs> When I say bored, conversation's mad dead. Like, truly uninterested. I keep asking questions. I ask the basics. I'm not gonna lie. First question I ask, do you have kids? Do you have kids and do you have a girlfriend? Because don't fucking lie to me right now. Like, you're fun to piss me off. Ask him, do you got kids? He like, no. Do you got a girlfriend? He like, no. Girl, I checked them motherfucking comments. He talk about faux ill, my lady with the red heart. You're a fucking liar. Why are you lying to me, though, Stink Stink? Like, you don't have to lie to me. What are you doing? Like, you're lying for nothing, yo. For nothing. Stink, I wasn't even finna hop in your ass the way I should, but now that you wanna be a fucking liar, I'm about to drag you to fucking hell. I guess he could tell I was about to block him, and he had a fucking problem about that shit. Why are you upset? Why are you upset with me creating boundaries and standards? I am not going to go for none of this shenanigans. My man, whoever my dookie booty is, whoever ass I'm supposed to be eating every single night. Too velo. Period. Too velo. He would text me back with the utmost respect. Now I gotta miss my light because you don't know what lane to fucking choose. Don't fucking piss me off, bitch. Are y'all all gonna cut me off? I must got chopped liver written on my forehead. Chopped liver. Ooh. Let me hop into it. I just wanna wake up to the sun and say, let run. Hundred thousand dollars on the. Uh, in the rose that's running, window spinning, they call that big spinning, big spinning. I'ma get back on my feet, give me a minute. I'ma feel this in my thighs, sundown, one chime, break it down. Wake up to that nigga, leave me behind. Dollars never show up on CP time. Yo, bitch on my line, she keeps saying that she love me. I can never love a bitch, that attitude too ugly. Drug me, baby, seduce me, and use me. Uh, 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 She said that she was gonna think about it. He got a text from the ex now. She was so extra, extra. Read about it. What can I do? Do you think I'm ill? So pull up your panties. I pull up in the fanny. Hasn't anybody told you crack kills? Girl, you're killing me. I need your energy. You're giving me something I can feel. I'm dealing right. Ain't nobody gonna tell me nothing. 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 Ain't nobody gonna t
can't mess with rappers, they be bogey. Bro, they get the pack and keep the open. Big trucker stand up in the ocean. Everybody trapping, we get open. He ain't focused yet, but he ain't got motion. Made a half a ticket off the motion. Shout out sushi, sweet and keep me rolling. But if we get the up, we got us open. Run around with Drake, like we yo, we yo. I got some rats and I want some more. Still got them pass in the wood, call it give and go. Keep a nigga, man, bitch in a pickle phone. Let me fuck when I want, I just come and go. Man, these rats get too big for these kids. Hold on, hold on, because when I typed in movie theater, I didn't know I was going to be off Shooter City. Y'all, wait a minute, bitch. Girl, this is where that fat, 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 these niggas out here shoot first and don't even ask no questions. Bitch, let me get my black ass the fuck on and inside the movie theaters. Hopefully, they ain't rocking. Y'all, when I was even driving up here, I was letting people cut me off. Go ahead in front of me, stink, stink. All right, it's $9. I'm going to support my people. Yeah, it always approved. I end up beefing every single time I go somewhere. And like, this is why I like staying in a fucking house. So I ordered a popcorn, right? Girl hands me the popcorn. She doesn't check me out. And I'm like, okay, whatever that fucking means. But bitches was being weird already in the first place. So then I start walking towards the register. I'm literally standing there. The other girl, she wiping shit down like she not talking to me. So I was like, okay, whatever. So I walk away. I'm about to just go in the movie theater and not pay for shit, right? I'm walking to the theater and she gonna say, you could pay over here. Hey, you saw me standing there for 30 plus seconds and I'm looking at you and you over there wiping stuff acting like I'm not here. But thank you for the popcorn, you stupid hoe. But yeah, we're at the movies. I'm the only one here though, like. Not part of it, but the whole upstairs. Y'all let me know, cause I feel like that bitch was trying to be funny and I'm not up for the jokes right now. Yeah, like me. Uh, broken two pounds. <laughs> popcorn second though. Cut all of this. Baby, I'm trying to get to the movie. I don't give a damn about these previews. Got me bored as fuck. Almost ate all my damn popcorn waiting for the movie to start. Yeah, I can't. We out the movies. I'm not gonna lie. The movie gonna talk about shit. It was two hours of just rambling. There ain't nothing happening in the movie, damn it. Yeah, only one big thing happened. If you read the manga, waste the money. Y'all, too much stuff is happening right now. So I woke up running late. Of course, that's my normal. I always run late. What? This is regular. Turn on the engine. I pop that bitch on. That bitch said 18 miles. To get to work, it said like 10, 11 miles. That mean by the time I get to work, I'll have nine, nine miles in this bitch. Which means I gotta pump gas in the fucking hood, bro. And I know exactly what station I gotta go to. That shit look like 555 City. Baby, I'm not made for this. I am a suburban baby. Half suburban, half, you feel me? I'm new to this cushy life, bro. Let me be comfortable. But luckily, by the time I get off, it still be the sun be up. I'm walking. Y'all know I put that shit on today. Because like I said, gas, $4? Oh my God. Ah! Shells? Am I going to Shells? Bro, Shells where they be doing that fucking hair on, bro. I'm not trying to go to fucking Shells, bro. And I was like, damn, bitch, if you're going to be this fucking late, you might as well go get some breakfast. Why is that your math? Why to you does late mean all the way late? Like, how you going to be late and then still starving? Late with no gas in your car. In conclusion, don't be like me when you grow up. Be a boss. Get your shit together. You say you're going to get gas? Go get that fucking gas, bitch. Y'all, like, I just feel like if I had a nigga to pump my gas for me, like, life would be so blessed and highly favored. But look at me pumping my own fucking petrol. Okay, okay, okay. I only added another five minutes to our journey. That's We can do that. They probably looking at me like, this bitch don't not never clock in. Hold on, hold on, y'all. I'm just a young buck. This is my second week out here. I don't know y'all like that. Any fucking who. Then on top of that, I'm trying to get in a motorized vehicle, aka the Porsche, aka the Hoopty, aka the Whip. And it's like construction out my hood right now. They doing construction. That's cool, cool. Do your construction, constructor. Everybody leans out the car when they saw me lean, lean. I said, what the fuck? If none of y'all are trying to pump this gas and pay that money on, y'all can't have no fun y'all with me. I can't talk to y'all niggas. It could be a can of paint and a nigga and I wouldn't know the difference.
Damn, this bitch full though, eh? Get back. I'm trying to play back that ass up. Everybody look at me. Yes, it is 7 o'clock in the morning. And I'm playing back that ass up. But come on, y'all. Back, back that ass up. You the fine motherfucker. Won't you back that ass up? I know you can't stand it. Big bandit. Go, get it. Yo, yo. I'm feeling on that. What's up? She's in it. You want some? Mm -mm. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. You got this friend. Ain't no cars coming. Girl, I can't see. Bitch, I need a motherfucking respirator. <laughs> what the fuck? How the fuck I'm supposed to go? How the fuck I'm supposed to go? You trying to turn, bitch. You could have put on a fucking blinker, bitch. Because if they would have told the bitch that was making a motherfucking turn, the bitch could have turned too. All right, we about to go into this gas station. See if we can take some Instagram pictures without getting um, murdered. He be feeding me pasta and lobster. He just hit me up on Tuesday like what's doing bad. Let me take you shopping. I told him, well, I'm a little busy. He said, damn, I'm in your city. But anyway, it's okay. Hope you have a good day. I'm going to see you by day 50. Then I told him, you treat me so well. He said, can't shop for sale. Matter of fact, scratch that. I'm going to see what's that just because you Fine as hell. And I said, well, thank you, babe. Anything for my favorite, lady. Well, I gotta go. They just let me know that I could pick up on the seat. Sunflower seeds the reason why I got jumped. I ain't say I got jumped over sunflower seeds. Like, they bitches was. What you doing to the flower seeds? See, they ain't do shit to the motherfucking flower So, why you getting jumped? <laughs> let me tell y'all what happened. So, I'm outside my hood, right? I stole some money out my mama candy jar. Mind your business, ho, because I do that shit again. <laughs> I really fucking will. I'm over there walking to the candy lady. You know, I'm up now. Nigga got $2. You know how many bags of sunflower seeds is? That's two. And that's the big bag, too. So I bought two bags of the sunflower seeds, right? So I'm over there chomping, chomping, chomping. Finish one bag. Dealt with it. Then I see a whole bunch of kids at the park. I'm like, all right, I'm going to go share some sunflower seeds with the kids. I say, hey, y'all want some? I heard, that ain't enough. My neck turned. Oh, God. And that's when I took off. You didn't owe them anything. Mm -mm, mm -mm, I ain't owe them nothing. I was just sharing. So I'm sharing sunflower <laughs> seeds and getting chased. Somebody tripped my leg. Where somebody bit my ankle? I'm not gonna lie. Somebody bit my motherfucking ankle. That's why I fell like that. Because, you know, I'm a track runner. I don't even play. I'm jumping the nigga. Doom, doom, doom. I'm over here. Trying to bob out the way. It's not <laughs> working. It's not working. I'm getting my ass cooked. Fuck my ass up. My hair all messed up. I'm linked to the side. My, my oh. collar. My collar stretched. I said, you know what? Fuck y'all too. I gave him the bag. Threw the bag at the bitch head. The bitch picked up and ate it. Fat ass. It's my mama house. My saw me. She said, who the fuck did this to you? Who did this to you? <laughs> I ain't know nothing. I don't know nothing. Mind you, my eyeball leaking. <laughs> my eyeball leaking. I said, I ain't did nothing. Ain't nothing happening to me on my granny. You don't know your fucking granny. <laughs> I tell my mom what happened. We go back out there. Kids is munching on my shit. They don't care. Mm, these good. They, they, they yeah. passing the bag around. Thought he was dying. They passing the bag around. <laughs> I say, them, yeah, that one, the one bag there. I'm pulling them out. I'm pulling them out. I say, yeah, my mama here to beat y'all ass, bitch. My mama here on business. She said, no, no, no. You finna fight her. <laughs> I said, no, 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 no. I did not just snitch on these kids. Yeah. And now you talking about I gotta fight her. Mind y'all, I've always been skinny. <laughs> I've always been a Petite young gal. So I'm not gonna lie. They line up. I gotta fight these niggas one on one. Yeah. First two, I get them. You feel me? I got my little dodge. You know, that elbow look. <laughs> duking on the end. That third bitch was. <laughs> that third bitch that got third me. Bitch got you. <laughs> that third bitch took me off the map, y'all. That was the first time getting disrespected in my hood. Y'all, me and Janae acting a damn fool in the fucking roses. Her ass jumping up and down on the kitty beanbag chair, moaning with her booty crack out. Not too much. <laughs> she said, well, not too much. Oh my God, look, they got a dollar clearance. Get that shit off me. <laughs> it's a crossover. It feels like crossover t-shirt. Yeah. Bro, put them panties back, bro. You're not here for them bitches. Nobody wants to wear that shit. What about, what about cute little gray set? Oh, that's cute. <laughs> oh my God. Bro, this, bro. I say we do the booty shorts and a crop top. Booty shorts, $4. Wow. Hi, thank you. That's what I'm talking about. Hi, can I have a table? Cheers. Yeah, adorable. Cheer. Oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. Yes, that's fine. Which side do you want? This one or this one? Thank you so much. Thanks. This is so cute. We out of Shooter City. We in Virginia. Oh, oh damn. The man. 
I want like TT, like, oh, okay, okay, this is herbal, non caffeinated. I'm probably gonna get this. <laughs> no, all right, friend. No, they not. You all scratch it all. Oh, my bad. Oh, my man did that because he was just like, oh, me so bad. Like, that's what I would because somebody asked me, why are all them scratches on your back? One thing about Janae, she gonna send some shit back. So I told her, don't, what? don't even get no tea. <laughs> yeah, I will. And I love her for being confident and standing on business when it comes down to sending something back. She can just drink mine. Me a candle. She didn't got me a look. Tink, tink, tink. They done let the niggas out of the hood. I don't know how to act in there. This is so cute. But right now, I'm looking at their dessert menu. They have a location out in New York that I really wanted to go to, but I didn't have time and I didn't care to get on that train to find it. No disrespect. And I don't know why. When it get dark in New York, I just hate being alone. And I was alone for that whole entire trip. Oop, almost burned my ass. Oop, oop. I'm definitely spilling it. That was really ghetto. Smell it. It's like, has he right? Yeah. See, she likes it. Good. Our food came out. We got turkey bacon sandwiches. We're basic as fuck. <laughs> we got the exact same thing because um, my big twin want to be like me. That's not my fault. I can't help that. Like, y'all, I just be putting her on. My biscuits tea. This is actually shit. Girl, you like the sauce? Mm hmm. It's right, real. Yeah. Mm hmm. I start dragging you along. <laughs> it smells so good. It gotta be a look. Why not? This is really cute. It, so. Still bring a knife to the fight and not kill him. I feel like talking my shit. Come in the house, take a friendly, you can suck my dick. I shot you. Do I have a problem or altercation every single time I come out the house? Maybe. We are at Target because I want to have like a movie night, but I want it like in the house. Oh, they did it again. The self checkouts is closed. I can't stand when they close them self checkouts. I don't want to talk to nobody. I feel as if I'm just stuck in this cycle of like making friends and then losing friends, which is okay because that's part of life. But it's like, why do I have such this high turnover rate? Like, what's the beef? Like, what's the problem? What's the tea? Because I'm not that bad of a person. Like, I cannot be that bad of a person. I think I might have bad habits. And I know that one of them 100%, that's 100% my fault. I am not a text and call everyday friend. I am a dependable, reliable friend. Like, if you need me, like you need some money, you need a car, you need a ride to work, like you need something yeah call me because i'm gonna get you there like if you was in jail and you only can make one phone call i'm going to be there in 2.5 seconds no i'm not getting dressed no i don't have to do my hair i'm coming in the head scarf bitch i'm about to be there in 2.5 seconds but i think in this like new generation or i guess what people are craving is more like an everyday friend and like everyday go out and like everyday type thing I'm just not there yet. This isn't the first time me hearing this. You know, I'm a little bit distant or maybe I don't text back all the time. At this point, I have to make a decision. Either A, I'm gonna start texting people back and being the type of friend that they need, or B, I'm just gonna be on this solo dolo mission. I'm also getting me some ice cream so I can cry about this. Yo, for it to be so late at night, too many people is out. Like, I can't even talk my shit the way I like to. I kinda have to make this decision of me being more like transparent with my boundaries and everything, but I feel like I always get penalized for the same thing in every single relationship, which is being distant or like not as consistent as they would like they cure depression i just think that's the trauma of being the funny friend somebody with like so much extreme emotions like y'all know how i get like really lit and i be a kiki key like the same way i be a kiki key is the same way i be oh instead of taking that out on my peers and my friends and my amigos i just go ghost which is like my fault that's a habit that i need to stop because when you're the funny friend if you're not cracking a fucking joke nobody wants to hear you like nobody i feel like and it's been times where i've like expressed myself and i'm like yeah bro like sometimes i just be sad and niggas would just be like ha 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 next topic it's just like oof <laughs> oof <laughs> You kind of ate me up right there. You're funny, you laugh, and you can get along with every single friendship group, but you're not like a vital piece to every friendship group. Like you're disposable. Like I feel as if I've become such like a disposable piece to people that it's like so easy to be like, okay, Cheyenne, whatever. But it's like, damn. And then when I do try to express this, they just be like, no, you tripping. And it's like, uh, give it a week. You see money all around me. I look like I'm the man Yeah, but I was done in the last week Tell me where have you been? Yeah, came out of the hiding girl On 
act like I'm your man. I'm just a fan. Put on hold, right? Put on hold, right? We at Janae house and she washing them dishes. Real bad. <laughs> yup, and get them clean too. We about to do her sister's hair today because it's almost Sissy's birthday. We been here. I'm not putting that mask on my head. What Just like hold it at a cute angle right here and tell them <laughs> what you been telling me at school. So y'all, she beefing with this girl. <laughs> She be with a girl talking about she talking to some little boy. What, what's the tea? What's the tea? So basically. I put my hair in these twists last night. I took them braids out because them braids was fuck fried and dead. I need to make this Instagram outfit so bad because tomorrow I'm supposed to be taking pictures. So that Friday I can shindig, but I don't even know if we shindigging or shin shucking. But if we not shindigging, shin shucking, that means we going to the rink. And if we going to the rink, there's this boy. He want to meet me out there, but it's like I don't talk to boys. I don't talk to boys. I don't talk to boys. Don't talk to boys. You niggas just turn me the fuck off. Like, I don't even want to be around y'all. But it's like, girl, pop that cat. Now that the niggas want me, I don't want the niggas. Stay where you're at. At your mama house. Smoking that eighth that you got on Nunu Street. And now your ass tweaking out. Like, don't come to me. The problem because you're getting hot outside the block. Getting hot. They know a bitch about to turn up on the air. Good morning, y'all. We're about to start off the day like this. You already know, if you have an afro, this shit don't be ready 24 seven. You gotta cook that bitch up a little bit. So I'm about to put some shine and anti-humidity spray on it just so I can get up out the house. But we are about to link up with my homegirl today. Yes, me and the homegirls is going out. Well, not really homegirls, just one, just one homegirl. I don't know. If y'all got a small circle, let me know. Oh, and I'm also taking some of this morning after refining foam by mixed chicks and i'm just gonna add a little bit of that in my fingers and just pat 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 that we're about to go to this cafe i've been looking at for a long ass time like i've been looking at this cafe for a minute but i don't know why nobody wanted to go with me and i was like bitch i'm about to go by myself until i called up my homegirl and i was like stinky and this is the fro for the day Jackson 5, yes, it's gagging the bitches. I think I need to recut my bangs a little bit because as you see, like, they're kind of long. But y'all, I literally cut my hair two months ago. So it's like, what's really tea? But yeah, we're about to go to a tea party. I've always wanted to go to a tea party ever since, like, I saw Bridgerton and I saw how them bitches was pinky up talking that motherfucking shit. I said, I want to do that too. But nobody wanted to go with me. Gag, yeah. I love my friends down, but I can definitely still tell I am the oddball of the group. Truly praying to God, I meet an anime friend, anime, K-dramas. This is just like a twist out that I braided at the roots just to give it some like stretch because I know my hair kind of before we leave, we have to take a thumbnail picture for my YouTube video that I have to post tomorrow. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Good morning, y'all. It's like 7.30 in the morning. I stayed up until 3 o'clock in the morning reading. Reading a book from chapter 1 to chapter the end. Literally, I have to wait for the artist to post more about the book because um it's called Cold Name Anesthesia. Don't read it if you are homophobic because it's about the homos. Recently, I've been in my reading bag. Oh, I started reading manga that was online. I found like this illegal ass website. And I've been absolutely addicted, right? You would think, oh my gosh, that's so good. Like she found a hobby. She's doing great. No, 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 opposite opposite of doing great everything is going to shit i'm staying up until like freaking three o'clock on work days just to finish series and they didn't even kiss i stayed up reading that fucking series these niggas ain't even kiss each other yet they still talk about some the other boy still convinced that he's straight i said am i reading the right thing i had to flip i flipped the book what are you talking about what are you talking about titties what are you talking about titties boy Boy, you need to lock in. Lock in for me. Lock in, Dookie Bot. Ever since I read this one called Shut Line, and it's about this man. He a mafia man, right? He a mafia man. He get his money on it. It's like, okay, that's cute. Whatever, whatever, whatever. His car right now. 
Mafia and me and car break down. He looking for somebody to fix it. And he see this man on the side of the road traveling mechanic. He just be around the way. Like, if you catch him, he'll fix your shit up. If you don't catch him, then he won't fix your shit up. So, the Mafia man see him smirk and then pull over. But it's like, why is he smirking? Like, girl, what are you talking about? You ain't even talk to this nigga. You will be here giggling at your boots, boy. You is whip. Mind you, this is D1. Big, big boy. These are not no little ass skinny scrawny though these mafia and a mechanic this is a, mm -hmm. they over there chatting it and he bent down you know trying to fix the car and the other me are like damn <laughs> packing some butt down there and he's like mm, did that guy just look at my butt did he just look at my butt pretty much mechanic fixes the car he go about his business for the shit he gotta make some more money on damn pull out a fat water cash throw it at his forehead what why would you throw that at his forehead like that Fling the money on his forehead, skirt, take off. Inside of the money was a business card. He was like, I don't really fuck with rich niggas. Literally, that's what he said. I don't fuck with rich niggas. Kept pushing. He goes to the bar. He drinking. Dun, dun, dun. But apparently, the business card had a tracking device on it, right? Tracking device. Man, pull up. He said, why didn't you call that at? What? Why didn't you call that at? I don't... I don't know why he didn't call that at. And I'm over here reading, literally blushing, like, oh my God, why did you call your man? I'm like, what the fuck? He asked the man, he was like, what the fuck you want from me? Like, be for real, what do you want? And he's like, I don't want much, but meet me in the parking lot. And I said, everybody, girl. And the other guy, he was like, I know what's up. It won't even on no, like, SA or anything like that. He was like, ooh. This is my alarm telling me shut the fuck up. The other guy, he was kind of feeling him too. Like, this isn't his first rodeo messing around with men. So he was like, okay, I'll meet you in that parking lot. Man, man, parking lot get crazy, dog. Parking lot get crunk, crunk. Parking lot get crunk. I don't know what I say. It was lit. It was lit. Fuck that parking lot. I was over there reading it like. The parking lot. How do you do? How do you do? I'm over there flipping it. I gotta take notes. I gotta take notes of this shit. I'm truly amazed. They start going together. But I told y'all, man's mafia, his ops, his ops see that his sticky be walking around these streets trying to fix cars. They about to fix his ass up next. Kidnap the nigga, right? Nigga kidnap. Laid out. Laid out. Told you his mafia, so his drugs in it. He laid out. It's like, we about to drug him. He wake up. He still drug who? Drug who? Too late, nigga. You drug. They drug his ass up. They're like, you know what else we should do? We should take a video and send it to the, you know, send it to the ops. So they like, oh yeah, yeah, let's take a video. And I'm like, yo, I don't think I can watch this. This is a little too weird. Man, baby daddy bust that. Boom, fuck out my bitch. I said, oh my God. Y'all, they don't actually say who the fuck out my bitch. This is just how it translates in my brain. Like I truly read it and then it goes through another translation of who the fuck out my bitch. He's stepping on toes. He over there, you run this? You running shit? And the guy's like, no, no, I'm not the leader. I'm not the leader. You're the leader. He take the man. Trigger warning. Um, if you're you feel me? Michael Jackson leaned that man over and shot him in his butt. Why why would you do that? Why would you do that? Y'all, that's only six chapters in. It's 80 chapters. I stayed up. I was like, I think it was like a Saturday. Homegirls called me. They was like, you try to come out? No. I can't go nowhere. Okay, cause do, could not, t because these two, these two over here getting shit rocking. Can't got my side. I gotta continue reading. And those are the books that I be reading on my spare time. It's so many of them now. I think I'm up to like 20. I read all the basics, and now I'm getting to like smaller artists. I don't know. I don't know what my life is anymore. But I need to hurry up, cause I have to go to work. What's my damn ass? What's my damn ass? Fuck with y'all. But right now we are about to get ready to go to work. Right there, I'm about to see how late I'm about to be. Uh oh, traffic not even that big, y'all. Oh my gosh, I need to leave the house right now. Yeah. Damn. Lauren, I don't need an echo. I don't need an echo. I know. I know. I'm supposed to put on these palazzo pants. I can't even wear this because I got some big grandma ass drawers and I don't feel like changing my drawers. Like, if your job not okay with you being late, I don't want to work there. I'm sorry, I'm not working there. Like, how your tits I say you sing? You gon' act like walk and give you love. 
shorty, you the coldest, you get ice Shorty, you the coldest, you get ice Be cool, be 22 if you just treat me right What's up, baby? Just have some fun, baby She gripping on my dick, but that's my gun, baby Oh, you like thugs, baby? Baby, it's enough for me to go Oh, 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 oh. She's fucking some niggas on the basketball team And that girl is me Heard all of the stories about you, I already know And I like it Why you gotta fight with me at Cheesecake? You know I love to go there Say I'm acting like shit, I can't take you nowhere This a place for families to drive Camrys and go to Disney All because of her, I don't do you like I should This is not a fair tale, I already know You don't wanna fall in love, I know I'm not someone you should trust, I know Line up a texture, I be doing that a lot I'm so upset that it's dark and y'all can't see me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I apologize for this shit being out of fucking order. If y'all already know, well, y'all probably don't know. Just got back from a trip. Um, do I just take trips and spend a whole bunch of money? Y'all motherfucking know. Well, what I do know is I need to start getting to work on time. First of all, I was not on time, not once. I don't think I've been on time for like a month. We go do better, though. But if you made it to the end of the video, I would just like to give y'all a special thank you, daddy. You feel me? I fucks with you. I fucks with you. I fucks with you. And I appreciate you making it to the end of the video because it's like now we're connected. And even though I did get a little mushy gushy talk about my friendships, y'all, as long as I got y'all to talk to, you feel me? We're chilling. I'm definitely going to try to find my editing style and what style I want to keep it on because I know a lot of people that post more consistently have like very basic edit styles like chop 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 which is fine i need to keep everything in order but my thing is i like to put all the interesting stuff in the front and then like the talkative stuff in the back because i understand when people click that video like they don't know me yet so they just want me to do that do that rah rah well baby sometimes that motherfucker is sensitive and i don't want to rah rah and this was definitely one of the weeks like, i was not in the mood to rah rah i was not in the mood because nobody out except for that poor porn lady yeah i sure did beef with that popcorn bitch because what why would you try to call me broke? Even though my nails is overgrown. Mind your business. We are almost at 3,000. What? 3,000 of y'all. What? We all just hanging out? Like, we're a little posse now. Like, technically, we're like a little army. We got to take over the world. I would just like to say, I love each and every one of y'all. I appreciate each and every one of y'all that watch the videos, that scan, skip through the videos. Use that timestamp, baby. Do what you got to do. Those are my manga books in the back. Y'all see them? Y'all see them? Maybe, I don't know. If y'all like manga, let me know. I can give y'all a tour. Maybe we can go manga shopping or... I don't know. Do y'all like anime conventions? This right here been helping me edit videos. You see the ADHD? Just ding, 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 ding. All right. I'm gonna go. And somebody said, give them that yapper, that yapper special. I did. I gave you that yapper special when I was in them damn Target, them damn cheetah, cheetah print pajamas. I just want you to know that was for you. Like, that's literally what goes to my brain. It's like random TV shows, random books that I've read. But I'm going to give you a different one. Maybe I'll give y'all some story time. Some more story times. But it's like some of my stories don't be funny. Oh, I did give y'all a story time. I told y'all how I got jumped to this vlog. Y'all got a fucking story time. But sometimes my stories don't be funny. Oh, I done popped a hole in the damn thing. But all right, y'all. I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're still here, love and appreciate every single last one of you. If you subscribe, kiss you on your forehead. If you like the video, I will kiss you on your forehead. Comment to a bitch, talk to a bitch, because a bitch loves talking to you. Y'all, in the next one, I fuck with you. I love you down at your socks, bitch. Remember that? I'm going to see y'all in the next one, aka next week, or maybe a bonus video. Oh, I'm not the best. I'm scared. I'm scared.